Okay, okay, we're here, um, but the, with, with the way this truck is loaded, we cannot pick it up unless we had a rollback. But um, I'm here, and I can talk to the guy about surrendering the vehicle over to you guys. Would you like me to do that? I mean, I, I can talk to him. I can talk to the guy about giving us the key and surrendering the vehicle over. Okay, hang on one second. Here's the situation, man. Um, they told us to come get this, but with all the stuff you got in the car and the dog, why don't we make arrangements with the guy for you to surrender the vehicle over? How about I come up with the money? He got five hundred dollars. That's all he wanted. Now he's trying. Hang on. To come up you with there, it. sir? Sir, are you there? Uh, the guy's got five hundred dollars to I give mean, you guys. I, give me, give me an hour, and I can come up with it. I've been work. I've been putting it away, and I got a little bit of it. Here, with here he is. Here he is. Got to speak to him. You got to speak to him. Yeah. Go ahead, and speak. Sir. Jim. Is this Jim? Uh, Sylvia, his daughter, but Jim's right there. No, 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 no. This, no, no. Th this Black Star Global. Yeah, it's going out of business. Right, but Jim. Uh, Jim Lowry is the one who has the lien on it. Okay. Chuck Swan relinquished all rights to Black Star Global a year and a half okay, ago. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, I know. I know I know you're on the level. I know you're on the level. I know you're on so, the level. But I mean, this is with Jim Lowry. This has nothing to do with Sylvia, his daughter. Sylvia is Chuck Swan's daughter. All right, so who's Jim? Who's who? Oh, you're here. Let me get Jim on speakerphone. I mean, I'm scared. I don't want to lose this thing because I have worked for two years. Yeah, this yeah, thing. yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was supposed to get it and being the agreement because with all the dispersal of all this other crap and I wanted to keep it, I agreed to pay another 500 above above it. So, I mean, well, I... You I, need to go talk to these people, though, too. You need to talk to everybody, that uh, these people that put it out. Put it out. <laughs> Mr. Jim. This is Al. Did you send somebody to pick up the Ford? I'm trying to come up with the 500 on it, man. Chuck said that they got Sylvia Swan on this. They got Chuck in this. D and E. Oh shit. D and E is is a holdings company and the Swans have hold of this now. Charles Swan. Yeah, but then but this but see okay. All right now. All right. All right. It's not open way now. Okay, how much I got to have? How much it's do not, I have? It's not, it's not up to me. It's not Okay, me. this is why Chuck rode by here today because he found a pickup. This is why he yeah, found Yeah, yeah, I can tell. This sucks. All right. Um, I fucking hate this. I I'll tell you what. Off. You want my cell phone number? Nah. Well, anyway, all right, Jim. Hello? God, this ain't the time. I can't handle no more calls. I, I'm losing my pickup right now. I'm losing my pickup right now. Everything. I'm, I'm losing everything I've got. All right, talk to you. Is this Charles Swan? Yeah. Which one, junior or senior? It doesn't matter. You guys are. You got okay. four grand? Who are y'all with? I'm leaving, sir. I'm an SRT agent. Holdings company that's bought out my lien with another guy against his pickup from the previous company that I worked for for two years to have it. No, I, I don't have four grand. Yeah. Is that what you need? That's what they're telling me. I have to have to buy buy out a five hundred dollar label four thousand. Is that right? I mean, it's up to I don't know. I don't, don't know, know about. Probably hire to come out and get it. Oh. But I'm going to tell you flat out, you guys are going to have to record out of here. Yeah, we are. We're not taking your car. I told you we weren't. I'm not going to take it. I feel bad for you, man. That's bullshit. You're going to take it tonight? I'm not taking it. It's, I got nothing to do with this anymore. I feel bad for you, man. This is bullshit in my eyes. That ain't, that ain't right. Today, today, okay. No, he's not because he took all that shit off Dad's Well, uh, here's the thing. Is that you guys are you guys have Dad a company. Your dad about. and your you guys are nickel and dime and me to come out well, here for a hundred bucks. Dad don't have the company anymore. Well, you guys aren't hurting. That's that ain't right.
You know, I come out here and raise all hell for a hundred bucks. I, mean, I know you guys got more than that. That ain't right. I mean, normally we're heartless, but for a hundred bucks, I mean, that's... I, don't, I just don't think that's right for Charlie or Junior or Senior to, to say you always got a hundred. I don't, I don't like being asked to do this for a hundred. Junior, but junior, but that not right. junior is Senior. For Charlie owns a lot. He don't okay. even have nothing to do. Part of them's my dad's that he sold. Yes. Yeah. Where's your dad? He's on the way. Okay. I don't know. You can squeeze, right? Is this like a family thing? It seems like it is. The more, the more I listen uh, to it. Right. He knew his dog. Yeah. Bullshit, it ain't a family thing. I just came here. Oh, this lady, man. I feel bad for this guy, man. I mean, shit. Yeah. He don't seem to be a bad guy. No, you know, I could tell just in the way he was talking in the beginning before she showed up. I was like, this ain't, this doesn't feel, yeah, this don't feel right, you know? And she's nickel and dime me, tell me to come here for all the guys a hundred bucks. I didn't know it was a swan family thing. Give me a fucking break. <laughs> We post don't cost a hundred bucks for a reason, man. Jesus. And then when she shows up like this, I'm like, give me a fucking break. She knows the dog. Bullshit, it ain't family. Yeah. I'm sorry, man. Shit. Can you all be gravy? Yeah, but. I know I'm going to get out of here at 6 o'clock, but I just took off early. Yeah. Yeah. Get out of here. Right, right, right. Yeah. Hi. Uh, I understand this shit, man. Yeah, man. I'm supposed to be a home in my recliner right now. Right, 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 right. Damn right. Hmm. Like, I'm going to deal with her father, but you can skedaddle, man, if you want. Or if you want to stick around and take some of the cash, I'm going to take my fucking hundred bucks and give him an earful about it. <laughs> uh, don't, don't fucking nickel and dime. You guys are acting poor on the phone. I understand, but you guys, you guys can't send me into battle like this. I can't back you up. How much do we owe you? Only a hundred bucks, because that was the deal. But I, I, I don't owe you any more than that. No, I mean, I it's, it's two fifty. It's two fifty. It's two fifty. But uh, yeah, I, I put. Put hundred twenty in my pocket. That's all I have right now. Cash. That's. I mean, a deal's a deal. Well, I feel bad. I know you do. I know you do. It's not you though. It's your father, man. It's, it ain't right for him to send people in here like this. Uh, I know he's old school. I know he's old school. Yeah, we're already high strung, you know. These guys, I mean, it's just, just he shouldn't be sending people in here like this. I didn't know what we were getting into. I mean, he. What an asshole. What is he doing? I mean, place on it, way out. I have no problems with it. All right, give me the key. Did I say I'm surrounding the vehicle? Yeah. Give me the key. How you doing, Mr. Swan? John. Um, you can't send me out of here for a hundred bucks anymore, okay? No, put, me, no, no, put me in harm's no, way. I'm going to take care of it. Okay, all right. Hey, all right. Hold on, I'm going to take care of it. He's a wild one, huh? Going out, right now. Uh, yeah, no, not in the future, man. That ain't right. I appreciate it. Okay, thank you. Where do you guys want out of the CRV tow to? Uh, four eleven Big Hill Road. Four eleven Big Hill Road. Where's that? You go out of here and you go Chatham Parkway. Yep. Go straight. Through Highway 80, yep. go into Dillard Railroad Yard to yeah, go yeah. through the okay. railroad yard. Yeah. When you get to the end, you'll make a left. And it was 411? Big Hill. Big Hill, okay. Now, it don't show the first house you come to it, not the first one. It's the second house. Hey, man, I'm sorry. I don't, that's bullshit. That whole thing is fucking bullshit. I'm sorry, man. Hey, man before you get hey. out of here, you got a business card over Yeah, please, All please. Right, absolutely. absolutely. What was your name, sir? Sir? What was your name? Tim Gordon. Tim Gordon John McConnell. John, is this your company? Yes, sir. Um, I sell little scooters. Do y'all repo them? Yeah. 
Absolutely. Any idea about what the price? Was? Uh, usually it's around 200, 250, 200. Yeah. Just uh, depends if we need a rollback for it or not. You know. Well, I mean, I, I don't know what. I, I you would. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Alex. Go ahead, sir. Go ahead. My question is, I had every right to get everything of mine out of that truck. I agree. I have claimed that compressor is his. My receipts are in that pickup for that compressor. Okay. You got to call the guy and go get your personal belongings. He won't look at receipts. You need to get those receipts. Okay. Okay. The receipt for that compressor, that's, that's a $1,300 compressor. You need to get the receipts. You need okay. to get the receipts. All those tools in there, some of them ain't even mine. They're borrowed. I'm working off of. I'm right. paying them off. You got to go see the guy tomorrow because right. he looks like a fucking old time fucking pain in the ass. This is my actual brother-in-law. This, okay. this is what they call, um, it's too much involved. There's Clearly. a word for it. Clearly. There, she should have never been involved in the, in the picking up of this vehicle. That vehicle is not worth four thousand. I agree. I agree. I agree. When that old dog rolled in here, I knew it was all bullshit. I knew it was bullshit when she showed up. It just didn't feel right. I'm sorry. Go see the guy, but you'll get further with kindness. You just need to get your paperwork. Okay. Yeah. The only way you're gonna get that compressor back from that fucking guy is civil court. And you can get that through the receipts. Put it this way. Just don't I didn't mention get that. Complete pictures of it. I wanted to, but I couldn't. Just just get your receipts. And don't but let them know what it's you, on that video. But that's not going to help you. It, it won't help you in a court of law, that. man. I'm just telling you, it's not going to happen. No matter what, you, if you get those receipts, you can get your compressor back. That's how it works, man. Should have grabbed all their receipts out of that truck. I tried to get them. Get, you, get the receipts, man. Call them tomorrow, because right? legally he, he has to give you the opportunity to get your stuff out of your vehicle. You can't sell anything for ten days, and legally you're able to get all your stuff out of your car. May I ask when, if I call you, can I request that video of what was on it when it left? Yes. Yes. I'll Thank give it to you. That you. I will. That I will. That I will. Yeah. Hey, now, I'm thinking about selling them scooters, man. They're, okay. Yeah. What kind of scooters? Just two wheel or four wheel? Both. Four okay. Wheel okay. Okay. They're like 50 cc. Okay. They ain't really heavy. Two guys can pick them up. I mean, I don't give a shit. I didn't know if you were going to sell them with spares, spare keys. You can spell, sell them with spares. I can drop the price on you. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to find a tracking system that's yeah feasible yeah right 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 within within within, within, within limits. It, I have to have a tracking system that has a battery backup. Yeah, up. yeah, you do. Because you know, I'm thinking about financing the scooters. Okay. But you know, when you finance that shit, people will disappear. With I I know what you mean. I know what you mean. You just got to have a big down payment and a high enough rate to get yeah. what you can on the front end. Yeah. I can get out of most of them. On yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. If, if a guy's paid the down payment 25% of whatever, yeah. he disappears, ain't going to fuck you. Right, right, because you have to assume it's going to be in a garage or you'll never get it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Or yeah. it's gone. And they're easy to disconnect, yeah. Yeah, believe it or not. So. Oh, yeah. I know. Yeah. Or, or require, uh, what I find more important than credit these days is uh, uh, checking account balance. An average ledger of the checking account balance and have it ACH'd out every two weeks. Buy weekly payments. Yeah. Much, much better with blue, blue collar than, than once a That's month. That's what payment. I was talking to my accountant about having an ACH. ACH, out. yeah, bi weekly payments. And anybody that can keep up with that, because it won't get a, When you look, I mean, you'll have some kind of criteria. When you look, you'll know if they'll be able to make that payment or not. And if they do it bi weekly, they can make it. If you do it once a month, no fucking way. What do you think his chances are of getting the stools back? Okay. That guy, the way he rolled in here, gotta he's going to have to go to civil court. Yeah. They left here. They didn't even give me a piece of paperwork to pick on that pickup. No, no. I'm telling you, it, See, all of it was wrong. I'm calling the sheriff's department. I right would. Here. I would. But no matter what, they're not going to do anything. You need to get your receipts. Okay. I got it for that compressor. Get right here. get the receipts. Okay, you got the receipts. Go in there and get your stuff though. Get all the get all your stuff. And go see the guy and make it civil. Don't be crazy. If man. I walk in there with four grand, he's got to give it all to me. If that's if that's the if that's the payout. Yes, what he just told me. It's got to be four grand. Okay. But see, I don't even have a clue that the, on, on it. Well, four grand would probably be less than what you owe, actually. $500 is all it was lean on. It need any part of tools on there, was it? Yeah. Thank God. Sorry about that, Al. No problem. <laughs> no problem. You just want resolution, man. All right? You don't want to fight this fucking guy. Who? Chuck? Yeah. You just, you know, there's no reason to. You guys are, both of you guys aren't going to get anywhere. You just want resolution. I just want my truck. You just want your, just want my pickup. You just want your pickup. Then, and then if he says yeah. a magic number is 4,000, make it work. I'm going to just call straight to 911 as request, or would you know a better route of doing this? Yeah, but you were dealing with Chad and PD. They don't give a shit. I'm telling you, they don't, man. I mean, you know, unfortunately, they don't. They're going to tell them to go, it's a civil matter, go to civil court. I think a, a scooter is not what they're getting to work on. 
Yeah. So it's going to be their fourth thing in line, maybe fourth or fifth payment they're, they're going to make. Well, see, what, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get it set up to where i got a guy that like mobile service. Yeah. So yeah. that way, you know, these are Chinese scooters. Yeah, right, Chinese. right, 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 right. They don't run yeah. like American Right, scooters. right, no, so clearly. If we get, don't keep it to where we can fix them pretty cheap, Yeah. you know we're going to have issues. Right. So yeah, I've got it. And sell to those college kids. Yeah. You get to the SCAD, you know what I mean? Market there, you'll fucking bang it up. And yeah, mommy's paying for it anyways. Yeah. No, Shit, man. Good to meet you, man. Sorry about all this. You're a hey. good guy, man. He's a good guy, man. Holy shit. You see that fucking crazy swan roll in, man? Oh my fucking god. I was like, man, you sent me down here for a hundred fucking bucks, man. Fuck you. I was pissed. And then he tried to give me a hundred bucks, saying, hey, man, is that good? I'm like, no, man. You give me another fucking 50, man. That ain't right. Fucking, it's 250, actually. But your fucking daughter was crying to me on the goddamn phone saying, please, we don't have anybody else. Like, you guys are hurting or some shit. You didn't tell me fucking Charles Swan, goddamn senior. Was the one fucking repoing this. All right, Swan, that's a fucking last name around here. That's an old dog, man. Fuck you, man. He got nothing but cash in his wallet. Ugh. That's why I like working with corporations, okay? Companies, you know? We need your W-9. Uh, we can't pay unless we have your W-9. All right, we gotta write this fucking shit off. Come on, man. The fucking old dog, he don't give a fuck. Ugh. Well, hopefully that guy starts selling some scooters. <laughs> I'll make no money off that deal. Eh, yeah. Doesn't seem like he's going to be dealing in volume if you know 